morning. So right now I'm actually at work, so I can't talk long. I have to go in, um, but maybe I'll catch up with you on my break or so. But today I'm going to be uploading a video that I've been working on for so long. And then I have two other videos that were filmed actually prior to that that aren't even up yet. One, I had issues editing. I don't even know what's gonna go on with that video. Um, and then I have a haul, another haul video. Those are both haul videos. One's an update, unboxing and haul, and the other one's a haul. But anyway, that's besides the point. <laughs> right now my hair looks a little crazy because I haven't even brushed it yet. I just had it put up because I do part of my makeup at home and then the rest on the car ride in since my mom and I carpool. So I dropped her off and now I'm at work. So maybe one day I'll actually like record that whole process that we do. It's pretty extensive, but it's what works for us because it's, you know, we both work about 30 minutes from our house. So anyway, <laughs> actually it's more like an hour for me because of the commute and then traffic anyway. <clears throat> With that said, that is that I do see that they put up a Christmas tree in the lobby of my office. So I will certainly be sure to record that, but I also have to decorate my cubicle too. And so I just haven't brought in my stuff yet. Of course, it's my first day back since Thanksgiving. So anyway, with that said, that is that I have to go into work, but good morning. I will see you guys throughout the day. I also have my acting class tonight as well. So that's why they're getting a full face, uh, full face of makeup <laughs> today. So anyway, good morning. Um, and I will see you guys a little later. Quick update, it's raining. <laughs> so I totally forgot that rain was in the forecast for the next few days and uh, guess who got stuck without her umbrella inside her office. So anyway, I'm headed on my lunch right now. I'm a little wet from the rain. My hair needs to dry, I've got class tonight. I'll probably be filming in class. So anyway, yeah, that's that. Um, I'm headed to lunch, it's my lunch right now. I'm actually taking a later lunch than normal because I had to do fill in for somebody that wasn't here and work the phones at work. So anyway, I'm headed to lunch now. I'm gonna go meet up with my mom. We're gonna have lunch. We're gonna switch cars. She's gonna drop me up, back off at work and then she's gonna go home, pick up my mom or my grandma and my sister and uh, then they will be headed back to get me to go to my acting class. So anyway, <laughs> Tuesdays are crazy days. They're literally just like so much communication and so much just, yeah. Anyway, so with that said, let's go get lunch with my mom. Okay guys, good morning. So I can't talk much because I have to go to work, but basically it's Friday. I did not film much yesterday, I think, except for a little bit of rain, but we can talk about the craziness of yesterday later. But right now, today is going to be an even crazier day at work. We've got some higher ups coming, some big wigs coming to our offices. So lots to do today. I'm actually wearing a dress. I know this is crazy. I'm wearing a dress to work. <laughs> I love dresses, but I just don't wear them a lot because I don't really always have an excuse to wear them. But anyway, I'm here at work and uh, yeah, it's going to be a long day and then I'm not sure what we're doing afterwards but it's either going to involve decorating or more decorating <laughs> so with that said I will check in with you guys at some point um, whether it's after work or yeah probably most likely after work because we've got a birthday at lunch so anyway with that said that is that I will see you guys uh, a little later but um, good morning <laughs> So it has been a very long day and I don't even know where to begin, but basically I had a very long, busy day at work. We had like higher ups, execs at our uh, offices today. So everyone was running around trying to make sure everything was perfect. We also had a birthday celebration at lunch. And then right after work, we came over to my grandparents' house because there has been, um, I don't know how to put this nicely, but there has been a huge debate about their Christmas tree because we got here last night and like a whole middle section of the tree was completely out. This is why I do not care for pre-lit trees. There are exceptions every now and then, but this tree just seemed to cause quite the argument and uh, frustration. So when we looked at the tree, I could tell that there was like a bunch of lights out. I said, okay, this was not put together correctly, clearly, because there was a plug that had nothing plugged into it. And I said, well, this wouldn't be there if it wasn't needed. So anyway, to make a long story short, there was lots of back and forth going back between it's a hazard, it's a fire hazard. No, it's not. I don't want to redo the tree. I don't mind redoing the tree because we're going to do it anyway. So anyway, 
very, very, very chaotic for the last mm, 24 hours. Yeah, 24 hours. Um, so we get here tonight. We squabble a little more about the tree. Um, and I basically said I cannot sleep with myself at night knowing that my grandparents' house burned down because the Christmas tree wasn't put together correctly. So with that said, Kill and I pulled off the ornaments that were on the tree, which are probably about a third or fourth of the ornaments that were. Yeah. That's are supposed to be on the tree, took them off, took the tree apart, about lost my gosh darn mind because Hobby Lobby does not have their like uh, manual instructions anywhere online and the company that manufacture, manufactures the trees, super sketchy. Like the website is the worst thing I've ever seen. I don't know who put, whose 12 year old child put that together, but it looks like a mess. So they throw them away. Yeah. So I called Hobby Lobby. They didn't have it. They, they didn't have any man, extra manuals in stock. So it's been absolute chaos. So then my mom comes up here. We explain to her what cords we have. And we've got this many, you know, male cords, this many female cords. Um, and then we have like this main big like papa cord. <laughs> That's like a, just like an extension cord type thing that belongs to the tree. Anyway, so my mom starts drawing it out. She starts figuring it out. And uh, sure enough, my mom was able to figure out how all like nine, ten cords this tree has all match up. So... To make a long story even longer, the tree is put together <laughs> correctly now. So and lit. And lit. It actually lights up now. All the strands are on, whereas like half of it was completely out. So that was all my mom's doing. Um, even though I told her to Shh, let me just do this <laughs> after she gave me her theory. Um, so anyway, the tree's on. We're gonna add a couple more lights uh, because the tree is a white tree, like a white light tree. But uh, my grandpa loves the colored lights, so we're gonna add those to the tree. I don't even know what time it is, but I know it's well after 9 o'clock at this point. Luckily, this is a Friday night, so that's good. Ooh, that was not a good angle. Anyway, so we're going to decorate the tree, get the lights on. I'll show you guys that clip, but Kaelin and I are in for this. Do you want to say hi? Hello. Kaelin's here with me. Hi. <laughs> so we're here, and uh, yeah, I only have makeup on today because of the meeting and uh, thing we had at work today. Otherwise, I would... Yeah, <laughs> so otherwise I would uh, be looking just as much of a scraggly mess. So, um, oh, not that you look like a scraggly mess. I'm just <laughs> saying that, like, I would look like a scraggly mess. Oh, my God, I didn't even realize how that came across. I look like a scraggly I'm mess. I'm sorry. I didn't mean that. I just meant that I would look like a scraggly mess because that's how I looked yesterday don't, So don't, yeah. and the day before. <laughs> so I literally got home from work, went home, said I'm tired of wearing clothes, and went and put on pajamas. So I came over in pajamas to deal with Christmas tree problems. So. We're gonna get this tree decorated so that they can enjoy it since tomorrow is de December 1st and we're already behind schedule So anyway with that said, let's decorate this tree elf power <laughs> Okay, Papa's about to put the angel on the tree. It's all decorated. I'll show it to you guys in a minute. Do you have a name for your angel, Mima? We have a name for ours? I don't know. I'm just asking. Mima always has names for random things. For what? Random things. Random things. <laughs> I've never named that angel. Ever. We should give her a name. What should we name her? I don't know. Barbara? Barbara. <laughs> Charlie? Charlie. Oatmeal. Oh, <laughs> oh, I like that little light right there. That's, I think that, that should be okay. That's adorable, yeah. It's good like, job, Papa. Looks good. Good job. <laughs> looks good. Okay, guys, so I actually vlogged these boxes last year, but I don't know if I actually finished editing this exact footage from last year, at least, talking about these boxes. But these boxes are some that Kiln and I colored on when we were kids, and uh, my grandparents still have them and still use them for their Christmas decor. So this box always cracks me up, this little Santa sleigh that I think Kaylin actually drew when she was, like, really young. Uh, but it's so cute. Santa's down here, and who knows who's steering the, <laughs> the sleigh, but I just thought it was so cute. I think on the underside it actually says. Yeah, it says Kaylin, age seven, almost eight, this Christmas. <laughs> so, so cute. Oopsie, now it's upside down. 
It's so cute. But yeah, it's just one of those things that every time it comes out at Christmas, it always just makes us smile. So love these boxes. Love that my grandparents still have them. And uh, yeah, they're super cute. Okay, guys, like I said, Mima and Papa's Christmas tree is all done and decorated. It's 1130 <laughs> on Friday night, but the tree looks so great and so beautiful. We finally got all of the electrical issues figured out, like I said earlier, but look at how pretty. Oh, she just shines. <laughs> So, so cute. So anyway, we're gonna go home. Uh, we've got a bunch of decorating we still have to do this weekend and a bunch of craft stuff for an upcoming trip. So we're gonna be a little busy and uh, yeah, we still have more stuff to do over here at Mima's house to help her finish decorating and then of course our own. So prayers, we get it all done this weekend. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you the tree since we're headed home right now. Good morning, happy Saturday. So we've already started working and we finally finished our mantle. Yay! <laughs> and then I just decorated down below the mantle. So that's kind of what we have going on right now. Uh, the tree, of course, we pretty much finished, but we have to add one more ornament and then the angel. So we're gonna do that right now and then move on to something new. So we have one more ornament to hang on the tree and this is actually my dad's ornament from his mom before she passed. So this was one of her ornaments that she used to hang and uh, we kind of leave it for the last one and my dad hangs this ornament. We of course do the rest of the tree, but this is his to hang. And then of course he helps us with the angel on top. So we're gonna hang this ornament now and uh, put the topper on the tree. Holly, what are you doing? You in the sun? You enjoying the sun? Meow. 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 Oh. <laughs> Up close and personal with Holly. So we fixed the top of the tree and now it's time for the angel. I'm so excited. This tree will officially be done now. <laughs> Yay! Yay, the tree is all done. I'm so excited. We can move on to other decorating spots. Uh, this room just had a couple little things that we had to tidy up, but it's all done now. So yay, good job, Dad. Oh, thank you. You guys <laughs> girls did all the work. <laughs> yeah, but you added the tree topper. Yeah, well, it's the least I can do. Right, good job. <laughs> Okay guys, so I just wanted to do a quick little check-in. Today has been a very interesting day, um, but basically, it's kind of late at night right now, but we just decorated the tree in our uh, office. I was gonna say our spare room, but our office. And uh, this camera is not doing the like these ornaments any justice. These look orange on camera, but I promise you they're like the same color as the curtains, which is just very odd as to why it's showing up like this. Maybe I'll show it to you guys in the daylight, but. Um, I picked up two sets of these ornaments. They're little pearl ornament balls. They're so cute. I'm just putting one on the tree for now because I'm going to film a haul video um, with the other set. <laughs> but we just have a couple ornaments on it right now. I still have to get my tubs out um, and add more ornaments to the tree. But I just wanted to show you a little bit of progress, a little bit of what we did uh, this evening. And uh, yeah, we still have some more to go, of course. But um, my Hobby Lobby, I know the last time I checked on my Hobby Lobby, they were all out of these really cute furry ball ornaments, which look not cute right now on camera, at least from my view. Um, so maybe I'll have to check one of my other Hobby Lobby stores and see if they have any more because they really are adorable and they really just make this tree just so, so cute. So anyway, yes, again, here is just a little update. Um, and I, I hate this clip already because it doesn't do this tree any justice. Thank you. 